and the friends from our, the press, the media, distribution varieties, ladies and gentlemen. I extend a warm welcome to you. I thank you for your participation. Assembled here for the formal inauguration of the newly installed solar power system at the Cheshire Home. Contribute to the environment in its own way by initiating projects such as self-sustained organic vegetable cultivation, promoting a plastic-free environment by making cloth, jute and canvas bags, etc. And more importantly, the installation of solar power system. The installation of the solar power system was entrusted to Mrs. NM Solar Power Systems, the authorized dealers of Tata Power Solar Limited. The laying of cables for the installation of solar power involving cables for LED lamp posts were also completed by February 2018. The installation of the new meter consisting of solar meter and the net meter could not be put in place because of the delay on the part of the service provider in commissioning the project. Earlier, Reliance Energy was a supplier of power to Cheshire Home and this entire Randeji area. And they have been awarded the contract of laying new cables and other infrastructure facilities in the suburbs. Subsequently, Tata Power Limited took over the distribution of electricity using the infrastructure of Reliance Energy. Consequently, MNM Solar Power System had to deal with two agencies, <coughs> namely Reliance Agency and Tata Power Limited. To coordinate officers of the Reliance Energy and Tata Power took some time, and consequently there has been a delay in installing the solar meter and the net metering facility. Through the net metering, we are connected to the main grid. If solar system on a regular basis to enable the panels to absorb the energy more efficiently. <laughs> Apart from lighting all internal areas of the building, we had originally planned to inaugurate the solar power system by the 5th June 2018. This week, the World Environment Day, and India was the global host to the with a variety of service and program being carried out in the 1.5 acre premises like residential care, daycare program, physiotherapy, occupational therapy, speech therapy, services for children with disability, mainly from the slum clusters of Andheri East, skills training for youth with disabilities, mother's empowerment program, etc. Cheshire Women has seen incurring substantial expenses towards the electricity charges. In Shesha Solar Power System, no through the support of Australian Consulate, we have now an alternate source of energy, which would not only reduce the Cheshire Home's energy cost burden, but also enable us to reduce the carbon footprint, thereby contribute towards the environment, environment conser conservation. At this stage, we remember with gratitude. We are very thankful to the Australian Consul General Mumbai for having agreed to support us once again in the new endeavour for the installation of the solar power system. On 15 November 2017, we had the privilege of Her Excellency Sarinder Sindhu, Australian High Commissioner to India, visit us at Mumbai Cheshire Ho, who, who see, saw our facilities, services and interacted with the parents and beneficiaries and presented to us the contribution check towards the solar power project. The Cheshire Homes India Mumbai was founded by Group Captain Nanad Cheshire, whom I had the good fortune of spending time travelling with him in the India and interacting with him. Following the establishment of Cheshire Homes India, under the number of homes have started in Lana, by Nanad Cheshire, so, a professional horticulturist, lecturer and advocate for preservation of urban ecosphere. The interactive session also included question and answer session. A short hidden rule are some of the new solar power projects being carried out by MNM Solar Power System. Due to the association of Cheshire Home, MNM Solar 
this event should in this wala for PR publicity for this event. Representative of media present here with us today. This is sad to Sajida Maskadi, Trustee Jashai Om Sindhya Mumbai for giving us this valuable contact with the Australian consulates and related resources. Sanjali Sir, volunteer and Venetian for her inputs and inspiration. Shirley Joseph Singh, Trustee, Jashai Om Sindhya Mumbai and a business person for her tireless involvement in the creative ideas for publicity and visibility. Our staff and many others who have helped us in one form or the other, I acknowledge with grateful thanks their wholehearted support in completing this project. I once again thank Thank you so much, sir, for your uh, 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 rescheduled the program in a way that we listen to you first, sir, and then we have the program of the children. So can have can we have a few words from you? Uh, the community, the students, the parents, and the others who will gain benefit from uh, Cheshire Homes' new facility. It's uh, it's terrific to be invited to this inauguration. And I'm delighted to be part of the Cheshire Homes India endeavour to practice use of clean energy. We're very happy to know that Australia's direct aid program is positively impacting the lives of children and adults with special needs and care. Uh, the consul Australian Consulate General has been that we had provided last year for the sensory garden that uh, you, you may have, have seen as you came in here lovely garden to the left as you come through the entry. Our support for this comes through the Australian Foreign Minister's 2015 Disability Strategy, known as Development for All. That strategy recognises that disability inclusive development is a priority for the Australian Government and seeks to advance an improved quality of life for people with special needs across the world. And we very much hope to continue to advance in the coming years. I look forward to continuing to work with Cheshire Homes and assist with disability inclusive development here in Mumbai. I congratulate all of the other donors and people that have worked to develop this new facility. Uh, I thank the board of directors. I thank Mr John, Mr Sanjay and all of you here and very much look forward to inaugurating this in the next few minutes. Thank you so much.
it's, look, it, the Cheshire Homes are, are doing wonderful work for uh, a community, including the children concerned, the residents of the community and the volunteers that are being engaged in a very, very positive way. Uh, we make a small contribution to, to that effort and it is a, a great uh, uh, testimony to the strength of a community that uh, it comes together and generates such positive energy as we're seeing today. At the inaugural ceremony of the solar power system here over here, what do you have to say about the solar power system being inaugurated and how it will help out and you know change the environment as well? Can, can you repeat that? The solar power system in our world. Yes. So how will they change the environment and how is useful it will be? Well, this, uh, the system that has been installed is a, is a, thir is a 30, 30 kilowatt uh, feed-in uh, generator, peak, peak generator, and it feeds in and means that the energy costs for this institution are basically eliminated. Uh, and that means that the community can spend more of its money, uh, the donations of other people, on the things that matter, and that is uh, upskilling and helping these people uh, uh, become even, even more uh, engaged members of the community. So it's very, very positive. It means that you, you, you focus on the main game, which is the development of the people, rather than spending money on energy, which is renewable, uh, as it's being generated. And how Australian government is contributing for the community activities in India and how the Indian government is contributing to the community activities? I do, I do not uh, uh, have a full understanding of the things that the Indian government is doing, but I can say that uh, we, we, the Australian government has, uh, over the past few years, uh, dedicated a lot of funding to Disability for All, which is a signature initiative of the Australian Foreign Minister. And uh, since 2015, we have focused on uh, projects and funding projects that will help uh, uh, the development of people in the disability sector. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you. Next, next, next. The system of the power system, sir. It's going to. Yeah. We are going to get clean energy. Okay. Without depletion of coal, hydropower, etc., that water sources. Okay. We are going to clean energy through which we will run this uh, uh, 30 kilowatts requirement through our solar system, which is supported by the Australian Council General. And talking about the foundation, as well, how it's helping children out and other disabled children? And how it's this, is, this is a purely a disabled people's organization. Okay. We have two main programs. The children, we rehabilitate, okay. correct them and put them in schools and uh, youth, uh, educated youth, we train them and put them in employment. So they become self-earning, self-sustaining people, no burden on the society apart from contributing members of society. And what is the vision for the future as such, how you are going to, you know, make the sport better and more larger as such? We are, we are enlarging our uh, work with the community, especially the marginalized section of the community, enlarging our scope, increasing the number of uh, uh, exposure of the disabled children through physiotherapies, speech therapy, various, various uh, methods of therapies. I think what we saw today is evidence of uh, wonderful community spirit. Uh, to see the children and the young adults performing was heartwarming, but to see the hard work that they put into it and the wonderful people who work with the, the community, it's, it's awe-inspiring. And the kind of support you are going to do in the future? Sir, well, I can't speak for the Australian government. That's my husband's job. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> शिशायर होम जो है वो साठ साल पहले चालू किया था लनौर शिशायर के थ्रू 
एंड बॉम्बे में अभी हमारे 50 25 ऐसे ऑर्गेनाइजेशन हैं अक्रॉस द वर्ल्ड वी टू हंड्रेड फिफ्टी ना टू हंड्रेड फिफ्टी इन ट्वेंटी टू इन इंडिया और पूरे दुनिया में 250 है और उनका सिंगल यही मुद्दा है कि आप रिहेबिलिटेट करें जो डिसेबल्ड है इट इज़ नॉट कि उनको उनको डिसप्रिफरेंटली एबल्ड है उनको कैसे सोसाइटी में इंक्लूड करें उनको हर तो उनको हम यहाँ से ट्रेनिंग तो हम कॉपरेट से हमको जो जो सपोर्ट मिलती है कम्स फ्रॉम टू वेज वन जो हम इनको प्लेसमेंट करना करना चाहते हैं एम्प्लॉयमेंट के लिए हमको कॉपरेट वहाँ पर बहुत सपोर्ट आता है फ्रॉम रिलायंस फॉर ऑल दी ऑर्गेनाइजेशन सो दे दे कम टू वर्स एंड टेलर्स हमारे पास आपके पास डिसेबल है जो ट्रेंड है हमारे पास भेजिए हम उनको कॉल सेंटर्स में हम उनको यू नो फ्रंट डेस्क पे कैश काउंटर्स ऑफ मॉल्स सो आई टी इंडस्ट्रीज सो देखे पोजिशन दे एंड यहाँ पर जो अफोर्ड नहीं कर सकते हैं जैसे वी हैव अ फिजियोथेरेपी डिपार्टमेंट वी हैव अ स्कूल वी हैव वी ट्राई एंड मेक इट एज जितने जन ज़्यादा आए जितना इंक्लूसिव है पर ऐसा नहीं आप यहाँ पर आके आप आपको आपका आपको एनपावर किया जाएगा कि आप बाहर जाके खुद का कुछ करें एंड दैट्स अ होल आइडिया विच शशा है कि आपको ला के आपको ये महसूस कराना है कि अगर आप ये नहीं कर सकते हो बट आप और बहुत कुछ कर सकते हो और वो बहुत कुछ पे हम ध्यान दे के वी गेट दम बैक इन टू नॉर्मल लाइफ दैट्स द होल आइडिया बिहाइंड